Okay, last video I forgot telling you about the uh, locomotive engineer's control stand, but I forgot to tell you about the dynamic brakes. I told you about the dynamic brakes on the trailing locomotive, our remote system. I forgot to tell you about these. Now I can't throw this handle because the engine's not running, but this is uh, to go. If we were in a power throttle over here, go to dynamic braking, we want, this goes to idle. Now we're in idle. You have to wait 10 seconds. Once you get to 10 seconds, and you're gonna throw your dynamic brake handle over this way, and it'll go to setup. See a little setup in here, that's what it'll say. Then you have to wait 10 more seconds before you can start your dynamic braking. Okay? Now when you start dynamic braking, I showed you over here the amp gauge. This is your amps. This is like a zero center needle. It'll go over here on this side, over here in the yellow, will show you the amps on your dynamic brakes. Hope you can see without the glare. Okay? It should never go over 700 amps on your dynamic brake. If you get too many amps, you get a little red. Do you see the red down in here? Right in here. Okay, and then you start to get warnings and and uh, so you got to knock this back and get your amp reach down. Uh, the dynamic brake resistor grids are set at 700 amps. I'm going to show you where they are I'm on this locomotive. the dynamic brake resistor grids are in here. What, that's what dissipates the heat. See inside? That dissipates the heat. There's also a bank of these on the other side of the locomotive also. All right, so that completes my first video. Uh, showing about what's going on with the uh, In here in the uh, engineer's control room. So now you know how to run an SD40-2. All right. I didn't give much of a... I didn't show you this the first video either. This is down in the nose. That's called the suitcase. Now that is the major control unit for the remote system that controls our remote locomotive. And I certainly don't understand it. It's full of valves and all kinds of switches and uh, but this control box here is for your remote also. Okay, have a good day. Thank you for watching.